Welcome to the video. Ayurveda uh, food categories, the, the doshas, uh, tamsic, uh, rastic, sattvic, how healthy, how real are these old yoga um, Ayurveda food categories and different body type that has its own food category that's it's kind of an unnatural thing because cooking is highly toxic nobody should cook 25 million animals in the world don't cook but they are hydrated by their natural diet a lion eats living animals they have blood and that blood is hydrating the lion when we drink water we don't hydrate nobody can hydrate from uh, drinking water water has inorganic minerals nobody can cannot absorb that well you can see that with water fasting at the end of a long water fasting people get problems to absorb to take in the water because the toxicity gets too high after drinking a long time uh, water including myself experienced that it's your food that need to hydrate you so there is not such a thing as different food categories in the world humans have only a species specific diet which is fruit so the water need to come from your food the tam tamzik is dead food meat chicken processed foods but that's not natural the whole thing if you think you are a carnivore well run after a cow and kill it by yourself don't let other ones slaughter it uh, for you and uh, prepare it for you that's not nat natural natural is you catch your own food in nature with your bare hands and try to jump on a cow and bite into the back of the cow or, or the neck then, then if you have these big teeth here or, or like a lion that shows you uh, uh, the lion as a carnivore the carnivore has a, a short wide digestive tube to process the meat the toxic meat very quickly to the end humans have 12 times uh, 12 meters sorry uh, long digestive tract and that cannot be that uh, meat or chicken or processed food is good because that gonna lead up to a lack of water these foods so that the stool of elimination is mostly 75 percent water how can meat or chicken that you cook be enough water to to make the stool or elimination <laughs> that's that's not po possible that's just not possible the lion eats the blood if you think you are a carnivore then you eat the raw meat with the blood and everything well good luck do it for uh, long enough and you will see
because food takes six hours to get through and it when you cook it it leaves 0 0.10 milligram in the small intestines behind every time you eat cooked meat or any cooked food is the same so cooking creates a krylamide which is the cause of death for many people in the world the toxic acrylamide and it's a chemical process above 35 40 celsius is a toxic chemical process that is dehydrating because you see when you cook the moisture going up in the air and that is how people that cook miss out the water for making the stool or elimination that is how people get wrinkles how people get joint problems and that is how, how people get um, bad eyesight and uh, need glasses dehydration the whole life every meal so the sadvik is the most natural where you stay calm and relaxed from the food if you eat whole unprocessed raw fruits and lettuce and then you check on Nicolaus from Fruitarian Utopia in Ecuador and you will see how fruit is making you relaxed and, and calm and that is for everyone the same because it's our species specific natural diet the fruits yoga is missing out some knowledge it's not possible that you need to separate people uh, different body types different digestive tracts that all need different foods that is not possible the thing is people might not do well with a certain food because if the cooked food leaves 0 0.10 grams in the small intestines it becomes after many years 20 30 35 kilo for most people that's why you see all these heavy people in, in USA because all that food is sticky food into the small intestines and then you might try diets diets never work it's a money business they work for a while but not for for long term because it's not a species specific uh, diet we don't need um, ayurveda uh, doshas um, we don't need ayurveda food categories only the sattvic is the only right one but the sattvic is humanity's natural food fruit and soft lettuce that has have high water content so there is an abundance of water in the body to make the elimination of 75 percent water and the body does not need to take like with cooked meals uh, water from joints and eyes and, and uh, skin to make the elimination so fruits stimulate fruits are the only foods that can detox when the yogis think that cooked food can detox in combination with exercise 
Mm, no, because the cooked food is not having the water that uh, you need for detoxing. If I, for example, I, if I go to bananas, I am nine years on, on fruits, I will feel super dehydrated because the banana has 73% water and the um, stool of elimination is 75. So my body is missing out 2% of water. That is why Lauren Lockman is recommending eat your bananas with lettuce because you're gonna feel dehydrated when, when you have a clean uh, body. The same stuff with avocado. Avocado might be higher in water, but the fat is slowing you down. So uh, if you eat banana or avocado nuts seeds, which are not a fruit, uh, there is a misunderstanding by Kefiramon, nuts and, and seeds are not a fruit. A fruit is something that grows on a tree or on a vine. It has seeds and it has sweet flesh or acid like the oranges. But think how natural oranges are. Oranges are, we know mostly oranges from monocropping fields. You don't find any orange tree in a primary rainforest where we originate from. But you find uh, jackfruit, you find mango, you find breadfruit over there. So that are real natural fr uh, fruits, ancient fruits, not human created mo uh, monocropping and deforesting causing fruit farming. Orange is better than the banana because the or all the acid are high in water content and uh, are very astringent and uh, they, they are very good to clean out uh, the body. Watermelon is a fruit, but watermelon is a human creation that causes uh, deforestation. So, watermelons are okay for an internal shower like coconuts, but coconuts are not a fruit too. So, be aware, Genesis 129 said, human food is only the seed on the tree that is surrounded by uh, flesh, by fruit flesh. And the logic is there, when we eat a fruit with a seed, we, we can toss the seed away and we, we take care of the reforestation in the world. Happens too with uh, apples and oranges and pears and in the colder uh, regions it happens when the weather is okay in summer there might be some seeds sprouting clean out the body by a juice fast you clean out all that sticky mucoid plaque which is in the body for your whole lifetime, you clean it out by a juice fast, a solid food vacation, uh, John Rose, is the best method because a water fast you have the toxicity of the water, but you need to clean out to feel you cannot say that one is feeling better with uh, cooked grains or that one is uh, feeling better with um, you know with uh, let me think uh, bitter or sour foods no no you know I was checking the the rustic uh, that is causing anger such a thing don't exist 
in a natural diet there would be no war there would be no fighting there, there, there would be no aggression because it's the food that is giving these it's because what they eat for example if you think food has nothing to do with the brain listen to this the old yogi was mantras he started doing a long fast no eating anymore and they were asking hey yogi can you still remember the mantras and he said no so they stopped the fast and they gave him food and he remembered the the mantra because there you see the food has to do with your brain. It's a big lie that people get a bigger brain on, on meat. No. See the gorilla, the bonobo, that's from where we we are similar to and they eat mostly uh, leaves and uh, soft leaves and, and fruits. So that is the return to the brain of Eden, to the origin of humanity, the equatorial rainforest where we belong. Tony Wright, author on uh, and YouTube ch uh, channel owner. real doctors there is nothing uh, good in the medicine or you know the, the, all the medicines are an extract from from nature but to the extract which which is processed in a lab they add all kind of chemicals and that is why every medicine has a side effect, but the medicine is suppressing the symptoms of uh, suppressing, uh, the, not addressing, sorry, the, the cause of the disease. It's just suppressing the symptoms. You feel better for a while, but you will stay sick so long as you exist. and nature does fasting when it has an injury or when it is sick it, it doesn't need to drink water because it's eating its natural diet which is hydrating human diet is not hydrating because no animal in nature cooks but we do Understanding the H3O2 is the only fluid that can hydrate you. H2O will never hydrate you, never. So your water need to come from your food. And even the yogis are in the trap of the water industry the more healthy waters but that's not natural the only way of natural drinking water is like an animal if you go to a pool in nature from it that is natural but why do you need to drink when you live in and you eat a natural hydrating diet that doesn't make any sense
drinking and polluting the earth, the seas full of plastic bottles, Africa full of bottles, empty bottles of plastic. Where is the logic in uh, humanity? Where is the logic in the old yogi knowledge? Ja, Rastafari.